Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to see how to install ANSYS student version on the laptop or PC. First I'll open the browser. Type download ANSYS student version. Go to the first link you get. Uh, where we'll have a multiple softwares like ANSYS student, ANSYS Celestina student, ANSYS electronics. So we'll go to the ANSYS student. From initial itself we have a download link. Before proceeding further we'll get check the initialization requirements. Alright. So first we'll go to the installation steps. So before installing we have some of the requirements here that the software will overwrite the pre-existing software and this file is come as a zip file we need to unzip and then install those are the instructions given here we have a system requirements here so the system must be at Microsoft Windows 10 on 11 with the 64 bit machine. So, there are a minimum hardware requirements. So, we may we should have a, at least 4 GB RAM machine with a 50 GB hard disk space. So, it is a minimalistic requirement. Most of the systems will have these requirements, and also the graphics card also some of the basic graphics might be required so this these all the system requirements and then since it is a student version uh, the limitations in the problem size will be there so the geometry cannot be exported uh, in this uh, free student version also the ANSI student version discovery the structural physics uh, limited with 128k nodes or elements fluid physics will have a uh, can have a 1 million cells or nodes um, for anti spios geometry can support up to 50 bodies with 300 faces and number of triangles 32k um, and for anti motion uh, it will support up to 100k nodes 25k contacts and 50 rigid node bodies for ANSYS Rocky uh, these are the requirements maybe the elements is allowed up to 128k and GPU is not available for this student version yeah that's it for license duration uh, it is renewable 12 month lease from the date of release so this ANSI student version is bundled with multiple uh, applications like these are all the applications we can access from the ANSYS student version and these are the functions that we can do with this software like random vibration, fluid flow, fluid flow, fluent, uh, linear buckling, model analysis, rigid dynamics, shape optimization, static structural, thermal electric so we have multiple functions we can do with this student version alone also geometry import uh, we can uh, import the geometries with the uh, format like IGS STEP and as a parasolid yeah that's it uh, with the included uh, functions for prior releases so it is basically 2025 revision 2 so Prior to this, we have 2025 revision 1 and 2024 revision 2. If you want these versions, you can download it from here. And the other softwares also they mentioned here ANSYS LS Dyna, ANSYS Electronics Desktop Student, and ANSYS SCAD Student. So, if you want to uh, know how to download ANSYS LS Dyna Student version, I have uh, yeah, separate video for that. Uh, steps you can refer it from my youtube channel okay now go to the download button so i'll press it so the download will take uh, some time 
ஆப்ஸ் டவுன்லோட் ஹேஸ் ஸ்டார்டட் அண்ட் இட் வில் டேக் சம் டைம் டு கம்ப்ளீட் yeah now the download has completed i'll open the folder and extract it the same location due to the file size the extraction alone will take some time now the extraction is completed open the this academy student okay open the setup file to install the setup file i agree okay so the installation is in progress will take roughly 10 minutes to complete now the installation has finished press exit now we'll open the ansys workbench to verify whether the installation has done properly workbench now the workbench has opened so we'll check with the one of the tool. like if i want to perform a static structural analysis just drag the static structural and then yeah we'll have all the options like if you want to perform a static analysis you can import the geometry from here and then you can work the model setup solution results from here yeah and you can also perform multiple analysis like flow fluid static structural transient dynamics random vibration model analysis everything we can do with this tool and yeah that's all for today video if you really love my video please don't forget to make a like and if you have any doubt please make comment and do if you think this video will be helpful for someone please share it to them and don't forget to subscribe thank you